One of the silver linings of the pandemic has been new breakthroughs in medicine and technology. That includes a better way to deliver vaccines. ABC 10 News reporter Jared Ahrens takes an in-depth look at a new patch that could replace needles forever. This patch, barely the size of a fingertip, could be the future for vaccines. Well, what we developed is a, is a microneedle patch. Stanford professor Dr. Joe DeSimone, along with a team of researchers at University of North Carolina, used new 3D printing technology to create it. The patch goes on like a Band-Aid. It has hundreds of tiny needles coated with a mixture of the COVID vaccine and sugar. You put this patch on and, and the micro needles are so small that uh, it's pain free and you wear it for a couple hours and that sugar will dissolve into the skin and deliver the vaccine right where all those immune cells that are targeting. Because skin has a high concentration of cells, the patch delivers medicine more directly than a traditional shot into the muscle. That means it's more effective. DeSimone and his team found it creates 50 times more antibodies than a needle. So your same amount of vaccine that you manufacture can now inoculate 50 times more people. Expanding supply is only one benefit. The sugar solution is more stable than liquid COVID vaccines, so it can be shipped anywhere, stored at higher temperatures, and last longer. And it doesn't take a trained doctor or nurse to administer, so this patch can help underdeveloped countries speed up their vaccination efforts. It also takes fear of needles out of the equation. A study in the UK found around 10% of people who are vaccine hesitant say it's because they don't like shots. So you take away the anxiety and the pain associated with it, especially for children and others, that there's a pain-free approach. DeSimone's patch isn't the only one in development. Researchers at the University of Queensland in Australia and at the University of Pittsburgh both published studies about their own versions, all showing similar results. DeSimone says patches like these are the future of medicine. I think you should design vaccines on the means of delivery. And so it's going to fundamentally change things. DeSimone's patch could start testing in primates early next year, but it's still a couple of years away from full FDA approval. DeSimone says even if the pandemic is over then, having this technology means we'll be ready for the next one. Jared Ahrens, ABC 10 News.